Hello, Jurgen, with your lovely nipple piercings. Let's go in the office. Alright, and what we're supposed to do is use this with the list. Max, distract Mr. Bliss for me. Hmm, I seem to be completely naked. Oh, dear. Hope I don't have to bend over provocatively to... That's enough, Max. All right. Hey, buddy. Hi. You lousy bleeper. Well, what about that time Jimmy Hoffa said, ride the Buckin' surfboard? Buckin' is not on the list. Sorry. So long. Later, Hugh Bliss. Let's read the it's list. It's Satan's grocery list. And that's great. All right, so hold on one moment. All right, so now we got to go back up to the surface. Yippee! <coughs> oh, goodness. why I'm yawning is because uh, it's like 11 p.m. at night and yeah and also this chair is really comfortable so I'm actually like relaxing and I'm not sitting on a broken computer stool that used to be a chair yeah all right I'm gonna go over here the boss goes Hey, Jimmy. Oh, I don't feel so good. All right. Want pork rinds? No way. I'm not sharing these with anyone. All right, hold on. All right, so I'm going to go all the way. To the left of the street. Ah, there's Timmy. I misread Timmy and Jim. You know what I mean. Feeling better? How are you feeling, Timmy? Better than I ever have in my whole darn life. Shoot! Nuts! Fudge balls! I still got the two reps, but that weird ringing in my ears has finally gone away. Awesome! Sorry about the casino. Sorry we ruined your dad's fancy casino, champ. Ah, that place was a real doo-doo hole anyway. Oh. I like having the robot alive. Because he's flipping love his trivia, just like I do. And he's got an irreverent, in-your-face attitude, just like Daddy. You're my best friend, you little imbecile. Ah, there's nothing more heartwarming than the love of a rat for his abusive robot pal. Glad to be back from hell? Glad to be back from hell. Oh, heck yeah! <coughs> You're just disappointed. The f hoppers never showed up at the hospital. It was my dying wish to see him. Because I'm their biggest fan ever! No, Timmy, that's wrong. Max is right. The s*** poppers are evil, wicked creatures. And besides, I'm their biggest fan ever! No freaking way! Ask me anything about them! How old is Specs? How old is Specs? He's officially nine years old because he was born on a midday. Sorry, Mr. Max. I'm just a melon farming trivia machine. Uh, Max is Max more. is the king of Popper's trivia. Bring it up! Wizard's Doctor. In episode 205, The Joy of Specs, what was the name of Wizard's urologist? Is that a trick question? Because in that episode, Wizard saw a gastroenterologist, Dr. Thundercolon. You lose again. Thundercolon. Max is the... Bring it up! Uh, Peeper's real name. What's Peeper's real name? Easy! It's Dick Pika! Ah! Sorry, Mr. Max. I'm just a melon farming trivia machine! Wow. Mac? Yeah. How many times has Wizard been married? 
four times. Gotcha! It's... Let me think. Four times total, but one was annulled, and another was declared unconstitutional by the Supreme Court. Wow. You lose again! Is there another Let's option? Nope. Diesel. Suck! Bye! Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go try to tell Sybil what a terrible mistake she's making. Sybil! Don't fuck him! I'm gonna twat swat you, I swear to god! Just don't fucking do it! If you want- if you were wondering, probable children who are watching this, because the internet, uh, twat swat is the female equivalent of a cock block. Um, I don't know why you children would know that, but you're on the fucking internet. So, I mean, you know, I might as well teach you something rather than merely corrupting you by my presence. All right, Sybil! Sybil, pay attention. What? Huh? What about Abe? Does it bother you that Abe's having a bachelor party? No, we should all be free to have a little fun before we're married, right? Try to stay cheap. Mind your own bit. All right, peepers. You just let peepers know how you want it, baby. Say my name. Say my name. Hey, Dick Peacock. Ah! What? What? You ruined everything. What have you done to his eyes? You still want to make out? Oh hell no. <laughs> Well, we've saved Sybil from a lifetime of regret. Yeah. And given ourselves a blackmail opportunity to secure our financial future. Dick Peacock, oh my god. Sybil! Is the wedding back on track? Yes, but now I'm behind schedule. Um, let's not mention any of that Peepers incident around Abe, okay? We'll okay. try not to. You know, a donation to my re-election fund would make it easier for me to keep my mouth shut. Chimney. All right. So, I think we've ruined all of their plans, actually. Holy crap. Hey, Satan. Good news, Satan. We took care of all three of those poppers. Well done, lads. Now come with me and watch Satan do what he does. I'm intrigued. Boardroom negotiations and corporate power play. No. Oh. I'm bum too. <laughs> You've lost, poppers. It's time we put an end to this charade and returned hell to its rightful owner. What Satan said! Poppers! Assume demon form! <laughs> Papers, the omniscient key of the death gaze. Oh, bother. Behold, Wizrael the Tormentor. It burns when I pee. Behold, Specs the Dominator of. Oh, come on. Those are your demon forms? They're different colors. Why am I always the only one who puts any effort into these things? Sam, I'm not enjoying the poppers anymore. Can I kill them? Not if I get them first. Banish the irritants! Sam and Max, we cast you into the pit by the power of the bell! God! And the book! Oh, this could be a problem. Oh. So be it. Satan, help! <laughs> oh. Well, at least there's plenty of light. <laughs> well, Max, unless we learn how to fly, we're destined to spend the remainder of our days on a tiny outcropping surrounded by impossibly hot lava, ash, and soot. I don't mind, Sam, as long as I'm with my best friend. Oh, that's sweet, little pal. Hey, give me one of those pork rinds you were carrying. Sorry, buddy. I already ate them all. We're gonna die! Ah, ha, ha! Somebody help! 
by the ruby red goiters of Rube Goldberg. Look, Max, it's Santa's sleigh. What an unexpected stroke of luck. Or is it, Max? Remember that time long ago when we jacked Santa's sleigh in an effort to save Christmas and drove it recklessly into a hellish vision of the future very much like the one we're standing in now? I stopped paying attention halfway through that sentence. Of course you I did. I wonder if our ghosts are here guiding us right now. Hey, past me! Check this out! Yep. Classy as always, little pal. Now let's get out of here. Well then. Wow. You escaped? That's highly implausible. Come on, Sam. Let's take this baby out and fly donuts around the seventh circle. It's out of power, little buddy. Guess I shouldn't have left the afterburners on. Hello, Commissioner. No, Sam's here. I don't know. He just let me answer it. <laughs> Is it cold in here to you, Max? I should have worn my mucklucks. I won the Nobel Peace Prize? Congrats, pal. I can't think of anyone who deserves it more, whose name I'd be able to pronounce. Okay, thanks, Commissioner. Okay, yeah, roger that. Love you, too. Do we have a new case, little buddy? Nah, same one. But Sybil wants me to officiate at her wedding. Well, that'll be fun. We'd better hurry up and restore the balance of power in hell, then. A little help here, guys. Why is there an ice cream truck? It's locked. Whee! Damn. I love how it's like blah, blah, poppers. I'm gonna go over here to the water cooler, cause why not? Good thing Mr. Spatula's fish tank is open, so he can enjoy the winter wonderland with the rest of us. Mm. It has three settings. Bake, popcorn, and cremate. Let's see. What do I have? Mm. Well, I have this. Probably won't do anything. Oh, wait. Candle. People really shouldn't leave ritual candles lying around. Yeah, no, it's not a great idea. Hmm. Wait. There's the bell? I don't like that we can see him digesting, Sam. It's all part of nature's hideous circle of life, Max. I think it's cool. I need... I need to go all the way over there again. Shit. Oh, dang it. Nope. Hmm. Nuh-uh. Can I put it in here? And that's one of the few things that... Alright. How do I light this thing on fire? Oh, wait. Right. Oh, no, it's frozen over. Well, shit. Um. Hmm. No, but I very much doubt that would work. Hold on. Alright, gonna walk around, because guy told me to click on it. Ice cream in hell, Max. What flavor is it? Hmm, looks like plain but. Now 
I gotta go all the way around. I want ice cream. Damn! Alright. Just a pinch of tar. Damn! Wait, I still have this coffee from forever ago. Papa Joe. Damn! Now, through the magic of television, let's see the cake in its final form. You make it look easy, Sam. actually hey guys I made you a cake I know three princes of hell who've got a special surprise coming why you 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 remembered for us oh you guys happy birthday poppers did someone say birthday Miss those guys. Don't ever say that again, Max. Not even as a joke. Well, boys, you've restored the infernal realms to their former glory. Thanks to your quick thinking and irrepressible spirit, hell is safe. I'm not gonna lie. I'm extremely proud of myself right now. That's we better good. run, Max. Sybil and Abe's wedding will be starting any minute. Later, Beelzebub. Sybil's paying me by the hour. Why don't you come by the reception, Satan? Really? I don't want you to get tired of me so soon, since you're going to be seeing so much of me later. Of course. I didn't like the sound of that. Don't sweat it, Sam. We're bound to get reincarnated as each other a few times anyway. You crack me up, little blasphemer. Oh, boy. Love is in the air, everybody. So hold on tight while we get on board the wedding train. Oh boy. Oh, oh yeah. Sam and Max season you two. Know, baby. Oh, that's right. Why are you with the brighter oh. room, sir? Hmm. I wonder if I don't like either one. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at Sybil! Oh, hey! You're wearing white. Interesting choice. Dearly beloved, we're gathered here today to celebrate this twisted mockery of holy matrimony. It's so beautiful. I hope they have lots of children. Uh, you would say that. Do you have the ring? Oh, shoot. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Hunter Buck says they don't last three months. Wow. Mazel tov! It always seemed like it was be a, would be a bad idea. Time. Oh boy. Denied! Fail! <laughs> yes. I don't know, they're breaking the last link. I get it, and but like. What is it that you do? Listen up, because I'm only going to say this twice. I'm a bug. A bug! Interesting. May I interest you in a new blackmail opportunity? But yeah, I'd end up cutting the shit out of my foot. Like, I already know. That's so sweet. Thanks for coming. Blah, blah. Thank you so much. Enjoy the dinner. Leonard! Wow. You put your left foot in, you put your left foot out. Play Love Shack, baby. Beatrix <coughs> Yay. <laughs> well, all this is great. Bye, kids. Have fun. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. That's not do a lot. You think we can trust him with our car, Sam? It's possessed by demons, Max. Can we trust the car? With them? Probably not. 
the end. All right, so that question mark. <laughs> so that was Sam and Max season two in its entirety. Ooh, but the soda poppers are back, or should I say the bleep poppers? You haven't seen the last of us, Sam and Max. We can never be defeated. We'll be back. We'll be back. Yep. Oh, eyeballs! Wow. Alright, guys, that was Sam Max Case 205. What's new, Beelzebub? Um, I hope that you enjoyed it and that you'll stick around for more. Bye, guys!